Future where everything has been destroyed? Or is it a distant past before the world has even come into being? Space time has doubled and twisted on itself. The past and future are tangled together as one, Koopal. The paradox is affecting space time itself. Right. And we have to find out what's causing this. within the paradox itself in this space-time the past and future intersect I bet if we solve all these puzzles we could dissolve the current paradox now you're thinking Kubo. This was their home, but now they're frozen in Cocoon's crystal pillar, never to return. They slept for centuries, and then they awoke again, in our time. Though they came from Grand Pulse, they became Cocoon's saviors. So you're saying they traveled through time to save the future? Yeah, I guess they did in a way. It looks like an Oracle Drive. Yeah. Stop. Sarah! If you change the future, you change the past. It keeps changing? <laughs> Change is the constant. <laughs> Caius. I have seen you. I have seen you both. You? What? You mean the Cirrus? I am not. Do you or you know? But... Uh, 
You must understand, there are many yous. Caius. Wait. I saw you. My sister was fighting you. What are you doing here in this time? I learned of your journey, leaping back and forth along the timeline. Yule has been watching everything you do. No. She's been watching us? Yes. I see you understand the significance of that. Then you must also understand that I am here for a reason. Your actions have necessitated the strictest sanctions. Hey, hold on a second! What do you mean, sanctions? I must protect the sanctity of the timeline. <coughs> you shall pay for your crimes in blood. Stop this, Caius. I am not going to fight you. Times have changed. I'm not the Caius you once knew. <sighs> to change history is a sin. It's too late. The timeline has already changed. But must we accept this, Yule? If you change the future, you change the past. You can remold history as your heart desires. Let's go now, before you are made to witness more. Artifact we have. I wonder how much we'd get if we sold it. I don't know how much it would sell for. It definitely cost us a lot. If we let it go, I doubt we could ever get it back. Of course, of course. We would never really sell it. She was the same. The same face. The same voice. But even so, she didn't know me at all. You mean you? Yes. Well, no questions? Hmm? What's that? I'm sorry, I wasn't listening. Well, <laughs> oh, that explains why you don't have anything to ask me. Lightning. Mo and I traveled to Erba. You wouldn't believe how much happened to us there. We found a prophecy that the Seeress of the Farseers had recorded. We saw a young girl called Yule, just like the Seeress. And we met a man named Caius, the man you were fighting in my dream. I guess what worries me the most, though, is that Noel looks sad. Sadder than I've ever seen him. There's something else, too. The strange thing that both Caius and Yule said. About the past. If you change the future, you change the past. I'm afraid of what that might mean for us. When Noel and I solved the paradox, we changed the future. Does that mean the past of Hope and the others has also changed? <laughs> 